Greetings everyone, this is Sergey from ZSK Germany. Today we will explain you how to replace the golden sleeve on the W head. At some point the golden sleeve might get worn off, which causes the needle bar wobbling, resulting in high rate skip stitches and needle breakage during embroidery. For this operation you will need the following tools. A cross tip and a flat tip Phillips screwdriver, 1.5 mm, 2 mm, 2.5 mm, 3 mm, 200 by 2 mm, 3 mm ball head Allen keys, an adjustment tool and adjustment needle. Remove the right side cover of the W head by unfastening the screws on the top and bottom of the cover using a 2.5 mm Allen key. On T8 press L3 for service, R2 for test machine attachments, with the arrow keys choose V head Z axis and presser foot local and press start testing with L8 key. Press the left side buttons on the W head to bring the presser foot down. Press L8 for main shaft position and disengage the brakes with jogging button. Next, rotate the main shaft counterclockwise until it reach 180 degrees and press the jogging bu button on T8 to engage the brakes. Remove the clinker. Loosen the top screw with a 3 mm Allen key from Z axis coupling. Remove the upper thread and protective cover at the back of the W head, if any, with 2.5 mm Allen key. Remove the thread tension unit at the top of the W head using a 2.5 mm ball head Allen key and be careful not to touch any electronic parts. Loosen two screws at the back of the Z-axis motor, pull it up and leave it aside. Remove the needle and the needle bar. Carefully pull out the pressure spring with two plastic bushings. Be caution as the spring is tensed. Loosen two set screws on the presser foot collar with 2 mm Allen key and remove it along with the felt ring from the golden sleeve. Use a long 200 by 2 mm Allen key from the right side of the W head to loosen the screw holding the pressure foot axis and pull out the axis. Release the main shaft brakes by pressing the jogging button on T8 and rotate it manually to 50 degrees. Then engage the brakes. Pull out the golden sleeve with rectangular plastic washer. Remove the plastic washer from the old golden sleeve and place it on new one. Install the new golden sleeve with the rectangular washer's long side pointing towards the machine's back. Insert the pressure foot axis back and tighten the screw. Rotate the main shaft back to 180 degrees and engage the main shaft brakes. Bring back the felt washer and presser foot and tighten both screws. Place back the spring with two plastic bushings. Insert the needle bar and slightly tighten the needle bar coupling as needle height adjustment required. Reattach the Z-axis motor by fastening two screws. Reattach the third tension unit with the 2.5 mm ball head Allen key, starting from the left hand side screw at the front by slightly tilting the unit. Reattach the back side protective cover. Ensure the zigzag head is at the 9 o'clock position and tighten the top screw on the Z axis coupling. Install the new clinker. Use the adjustment part and adjustment needle to adjust the needle height. 
You can find the link to a separate video on how to do it below. Apply Isoflex Topaz L32 grease on the golden sleeve and pressure foot bracket. Disengage the brakes and manually rotate the main shaft counterclockwise at least one full turn, ensuring smooth operation. Position it at 64 degrees and re-engage the brakes. Reattach the left side cover of the W head. Press the R8 button on T8 to stop testing. Reattach the front plate and front cover and operate the machine as usual. This was the full process of replacing the golden sleeve on your ZSK embroidery machine. For further assistance, you can contact your local agency whose contact details you will find at ZSK website. Below this video, you will find links to purchase tools and parts used in this demonstration. Thank you for watching and see you next time.